Power Rangers action figures. Let's talk some more about Power Ranger Lost Galaxy action figures. And today we're gonna talk about the basic fi figures, the Rangers, the the very standard toys we actually buy. So here we have the talking Power Ranger Lost Galaxy figure. It has the Quasar Saber and the Trans Dagger, which are the weapons they actually use in the show. But the, he also has a backpack and some toy exclusive weapon. This exclusive weapon is uh, it's pretty neat. I, I wonder why it's only it's it is painted because it, it is a toy's exclusive weapon and it, it's painted. And the uh, weapons that actually appear in the show are not painted; they're just gray. Why? <laughs> why is that? But nonetheless, it's a very nice figure. We have the Green Ranger, which also the Trans Dagger on bow on Beast mode or Bow mode. I don't know exactly. And the exclusive weapon here, pretty awesome. We also have the Blue Ranger with uh, with Trans Dagger claw and the exclusive weapon. The Yellow Ranger with both daggers. And some shoes over here. <laughs> I wonder why the the female rangers have shoes. And also here we have the exclusive weapon, which I don't know what it is exactly. <laughs> the pink ranger, trans dagger, bow mode, weapon, exclusive weapon, backpack, and shoes. They have some pretty nice sculpt, and I, I really enjoy this design for the figures. It also have the talking Magna Defender. He doesn't have a backpack, but he all he got some weapons too. The the evil ring, the evil space alien, and the space android. Then we have the blasting Power Ranger Lost Galaxy, and the mode for this figure, I I have to say, I didn't like much because it looks much more. Bulky and muscular, very different from the previous figure. Um, but at least it has a gimmick with the weapon. You you press the their legs and a gimmick happens with the weapon. Weapon in this case the the sky, the sword like weapon uh, goes forward. It folds out of the weapon and becomes a karate shop sword. Which is a very nice gimmick, I have to say. And here we have the Green Ranger with no extra weapon, just his mega weapon. His weapon spins like a, uh, some sort of uh, Lady Equator blades. We, we have to turn the dial on the back. He doesn't have leg action, which you can squeeze. You have to turn a, a dial on his back and rolls the the weapon and here we have the blue ranger with with a weapon that opens you have to squeeze the leg extra weapon here and here we have the yellow ranger which i broke my yellow ranger trying to make the gimmick because it opens the the missile and fire it was supposed to fire the missile but i pressed my yellow ranger and, and the leg broke not the one with the, the leg with the gimmick, the other leg, because I squeezed it too much. So, <laughs> I don't recommend you guys to squeeze your Yellow Ranger. <laughs> or as you break it. And here we have the Pink Ranger with the extra weapon. And some shaking like crazy weapon. And then the Magda Defender with, with a very similar weapon to the, to the Green Ranger. But also no extra weapon yeah then we have the Explorer Power Ranger the Red Ranger uh, it comes with an, an armor which I really enjoy I really enjoy Power Rangers with armors because I don't know because Knights of the Zodiac and this one would be a very nice one to to be to be a tie-in with the Knights of the Zodiac because here in Brazil the voice actor for this Power Ranger, the, the Red Ranger, was the same as Seiya from Knights of the Zodiac, or Saint Seiya, if you want to call it, call that. 
it would be really nice a crossover between the two series. Uh, <laughs> and this Explorer Red Ranger is pretty cool. He, he got some armor and some action claw. I really wish I could have this toy, but I don't have, and it's very expensive to buy it online not these days. Then we have the Green Ranger, also with an armor, some crazy claw, and an extra gadget. The Blue Ranger, with a claw, and some extra weapon here. This one kind of reminds of the Lunar in in Space Ranger. Maybe the f they got the same mold and it butts in with the figure, who knows. The Yell Ranger. Oh, she comes with a trans dagger. Cool. The claw, the armor, extra weapon, and a trans dagger. That's neat. And the yell uh, and for the pink ranger the same. She comes with a bow too. Awesome. Pretty awesome. The Magna Defender. The armor and his weapons too. Cool. That's cool. Then we have the Armored Power Ranger, which is my favorite. Not because I just have it on my childhood, but because uh, the Red Ranger actually used this weapon mode here to defeat Rakina. That It's a very epic scene. And man, th this toy deserves a reprint. reprint. Man, Hasbro, if you listen to this, <laughs> make a reprint of this toy. Because boy, oh boy, that's a very... Very awesome toy. The Armored Power Ranger can display with the lights of Orion by itself. It's very cool. And you can actually use the the weapons, the the extra armor weapon, which is very nice. And we have not only the Red Ranger, but we have the Green Ranger, which was part of my childhood. I have this I had this toy when I was a kid. It was very nice. I, I love this this toy. And we have the Blue Ranger. Awesome. I wonder why they didn't make the Magna Defender or the girls. The girls I kind of understand because the girls, eh, they didn't sell well. But the Magna Defender should have an armor version. But maybe, maybe they didn't do it because Magna Defender never used the Lights, lights of Warrior, uh, Orion. But it would be cool if the, he could have the Knights, Lights of Orion power up. It would be very awesome. <laughs> Moving on, we have the Conquering Power Ranger, which is a, a scale up from the standard armor, because this armor not just becomes an armor, but also becomes a beast-like armor, pretty much like Knights of the Zodiac. <laughs> the Knights of Zodiac, they their armor becomes some, be they have the beast form with are in display, but also they they become their armor when attached to the warrior, and man. I really want, wanted this toy, but currently it's very difficult to find online with all the pieces together. But it would make a nice toy, an awesome toy. The green conquering Power Ranger and the blue conquering Power Ranger. Uh, for what I can say, the green looks like transparent, which is very nice, but the blue one doesn't. I wonder why. And we have the conquering Magna Defender too. Which is pretty neat too. And here we have the Astro Cycle. Oh boy, I love this Astro Cycle. I bought one some years ago and I really love it. It's on my shelf of display, the Green Ranger on the Astro Cycle. I bought the Red and, and Magna Defender too. I guess the blue one too. And man, I really love this. This, this armor because you have a Power Ranger toy with a motorcycle with an armor that can switch between both the Ranger and the cycle that, that that's cool that's the cooler than cool the only cooler toy than than this one is the the trans armor from the Power Ranger like Speed Rescue but that's another video <laughs> that's a story for another video man we have the Green Ranger, which I have, and I made lots of reviews of this toy. You can check out on the playlist. The Blue Ranger and the Magna Defender Astro Cycle. Which I have to say, the Magna Defender's uh, armor is sort of a less than the other Rangers. For, uh, for what I can tell, we have one, two, 
three, one, two, three, four pairs of armor here on the Blue Ranger. But the Megalo Defender has only three uh, pairs of armor. Why? I wonder why. Or maybe it's on display. It's not on display on the box, but I, I doubt because. Yeah. Uh, all the Rangers have display an extra piece of armor here, but the Magna Defender don't. I wonder why. Then we have the Capsular Cycle. The Capsular Cycle is an evolution of the standard Astro Cycle, the same way that the Conqueror was supposed to be an evolution of the standard armor. And it is cool that the toy that comes with the Astro Cycle, they have the Lights of Orion attached to it, besides the claw, they don't have the claw, but I guess I understand why, because it would be difficult to... to to drive the motorcycle without with the claw <laughs> it makes a lot of sense you have the red ranger the green ranger the blue ranger it's a nice effect huh green blue and magna defender awesome although the 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 cycle uh, is pretty much the same they they should change bet uh, like the the animals change but whatever <laughs> Then we have the Jet Jammers, and I guess the figure of the Jet Jammers is the same as the Capsular toy figure. The Capsule, the Capsule Cycle. Yeah, they're pretty much the same. Let's see the Red Ranger. Yeah, it's very hard to tell one from another because they, they are very similar action figure. If not the same, the exact same mode. And here we have the Jet Jammer, the Extra Weapon, and the Ranger. Jet Jammer, Extra Weapon, and the Ranger. Oh, we have the Yellow Ranger, Jet Jammer. And the Pink Ranger, Jet Jammer. Very cool. And the Magnet Defender. They all, they all have the Jet Jammer versions of that. Pretty cool. If you see this weapon here, kind of looks the same as the weapon from the Titanic Ranger, I guess. Or and I might just imagine things, whatever. <laughs> then we have the Automorphin Power Ranger, and this one is is a classic because the Automorphin Rangers are awesome from back in the day. And but this one has wireless morphin action. It was wireless because before wireless was even a thing in gaming. <laughs> so that's Power Ranger for you guys. It comes with a trans trans dagger and a morpher that make the ranger automorph in wireless action. Awesome. A weapon here, wireless action morpher and a wireless action morphin. And the Silver Ranger is here <laughs> because it was very popular, I guess, from that time. I really like the Silver Ranger when he appeared. And that's it. That's all the Power Rangers action figures from the Lost Galaxy toy line. I, and this video, I just review only the Rangers, only the figures. I didn't reveal Zords, weapons, and other stuff. I have a complete video for that. Check on the link in the description below and the card. See you next time, Power Rangers, the power is on.